right, round Adrian. four pioneer. Ah. Both kept seven. Both kept seven. Going back to my roots. Like tap land, the scries. I know that feeling. Yeah, I thought it might have We'll keep it. Okay. Nice. Uh, I will play a Plains and Pass. Pass. I'm going to play Mountain, tap two. I'm going to play Ember Heart Challenger. He is a 2 2 haste prowess and valiant. Whenever I trigger him for the first time and any uh, spell, uh, target by spell ability for the first time and eat any turn, sure. I exit the top card of my library and may play that till the end of turn. Yeah. You're an And I'll pass. Forge. Are you playing um, caretakers? Yeah. Attack for one. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Untap. Draw. Needle first pathways land for term. I'm gonna play a Mabel. Yep. Three three and she gives a lord and she makes a oh, good frag flame. Yeah. Where my token? There my token. And then I'll pass her. I don't want you playing, so I don't know which one is gonna be her. <laughs> That's probably not the correct one. But it's the one that's like out of my Play Nerex. Play Fable. Yeah. Sure. Great. Make those moves. I don't know if that takes right. all of these tokens to yeah. make this I deck know. work. That is a problem. I have been seeing it a bit in Arena and stuff lately, and I, was, I, I had a game where I was like, oh, I am for sure going to kill him. I made, the one thing I made math wrong was I keep I, uh, Coiling Rebirth, I forget it gives it offspring, it doesn't make a copy. So I thought I was going to get two 7-7s seven seven with menace, and I got a 7-7 seven seven menace and a 1-1 one one with menace. Yeah. So, so. Uh, move to combat with 2-1. Uh, I will put a 3-3 three three front. And pass. All right. Untap. Draw. That is a cool yeah. top deck. I oh, I knew what you were playing. I watched this play. Uh, gotcha. I thought you said the planes. It's land for turn. Oh, the, I thought you said you didn't know what I was I'm going to tap 4. Like, no, and I'm going to offspring a manifold mouse. <laughs> okay. So I will get a second manifold mouse. And at the beginning of combat in my turn, target mouse I control Two gains my choice of double strike or trample. Okay. So I'm going to go to combat. Okay. Triggers. Yep. Double strike and trample. All right. Swing with a 3 3 double strike trample. I'm just going to take it. Okay. Take, Take six. six. Go to 17. Pass her. Let's actually draw first and then you decide. Yeah. I to sideboard this out. Um, yeah. I'm going to discard one to yep. draw one. Two, two. Go ahead and take five. Treasure token from the shaman. Go to fourteen. Hello. Sunfall. Mm -hmm. Well, oh, that's a good one. Um, you had two. I had three creatures. Three, and I had two. I was trying to get that out of Let's see if he does it. Quavery. Or, uh, you got it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yep. 13. Uh, yeah. 
Yeah. It's going to be three more turns until well, so I, I saw another creature, and it was just another maple. Okay. Yeah, I had some damage uh, coming. It, well, you, I was dead next turn. Yeah. Five, four, I guess it was only six, so six, 11. You only need three more, so you need a lightning heal, because I was dead. Yeah. Yeah. 11? Shoulder? It wasn't the next card, but... I mean, like I said, I've seen the deck in action. All it takes is one turn next thing you know, yep, hey, uh, I now am making 600 things in a turn. Yes. Like, yeah. it... It's like frogs, where it's a control deck that just sits there and takes 45 game actions on its own turn, or whenever it does anything. And it accomplishes like three things in doing it. Yeah. I love the Caretaker's Talent, because it keeps your hand full, but even if you don't draw, you didn't draw tear, there's enough other stuff going on in the deck that you can keep a game going. You're not just dead without it. Those tokens. This is sideboard. I mean, you're for sure running. So I might as well. Quite badly. That's a token. So I would lose four life, is that correct? Yeah, if you don't want to do it, you just four life. No. I mean, I'm not countering it because it costs six. So right. <laughs> There's nothing I can do with that. Yeah. Like, yeah, I'm going to negate your cocoa yeah, yeah, at the end of turn. And yeah, yeah, yeah. There's, there's no Were you sitting there for the last game? Yeah. Yeah. Is it just an epic battle or what? Honestly, kind of, but not for like the right reasons. Okay. Like neither of our decks quite did what they want. Like they were doing things, but not the things they wanted to. Okay. Um, like game two, I floated. He got nothing. And then game three was the first time I saw his innkeeper's talent, which he had to he milled because it was already so late in the game, it didn't make a difference for him. And then the. Um, other, uh, it was the first time I also saw any of his planeswalkers. Okay, mm -hmm. that's yeah, yeah, that makes for a slow game when the power's we, we ended up drawing basically going to turns, and it's like I, I got through two shieldreds. Uh -huh. Well, technically, the last one died in the last turn, which we can't really count because his blocks were made knowing that he didn't have to, mm -hmm. he just had to survive, he didn't have to worry about untapping. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, sorry, yeah, he didn't have to worry about what to do after untapping. Yeah, yeah unfortunately, mean, Sunfall, I still think Sunfall is bannable. Really? Yeah, it's okay. it's a board wipe that you can't do really anything to protect yourself from if you're not if you can't counter it. Yeah, Exile Island really causes a problem. Yeah. Heroic Intervention and Dawn's Truce, their new white protection spell. Neither of them do anything. Yeah. What does it? Because this says each opponent, right? Tax yeah. or each player exiles. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. giving yourself hex proof doesn't matter because of the the uh, verbiage on it. Yeah. Sacrifice a non permanent. Or Like, do I think it's? I just think it's too strong for the fact that it makes it so you, there's no other. The only other correct board wipe to run if you're is if you're in blue and that's the supreme verdict just because it can't be countered right and then farewell if you're in mono white because one more as well but you still are running supreme ver uh not supreme verdict the uh, sunfall first i've been the play this time i like the tokens that you get from it that's why you put it in this deck because then it triggers and, the character well, it's also control yeah, yeah. yeah that's the big thing is you're you're yes. the, you're it's the not just destroying you're one the control deck that so. doesn't use the stack yeah so you need to control everything else 
think this is the food one. Heart yeah. of the cards. Swing a 1-1 one, one okay. for damage. Monstrous Rage. So he's going to get a 1-1 one, one counter and he'll do, hit you for 5. 15. And he gets his monster. He's a monster mouse. Yep. And I will pass her. He's a 3-3. Three, three. And it, when he dies, he'll deal 3 damage to each opponent. Okay. Damage equal to his power, so. Right. Okay. Uh, you'll take 3 to your face. Pass. Draw. I will shock myself. Go to 18. Uh, and then I will pay three manas. I will play a Mabel. Okay. And she is a lord, so he gets plus one, plus one. So I'll attack you for two. And I'll pass her. Taking half my life in three turns. Look, if you get to five mana, my board could just be gone. That's true. Very true. Drop turn. If, if I can't kill you before turn five, I am losing. I need a bad Like, if it's a lord, you're dead. Yeah. Like, add two draws. Just two lands, and. It's only. Oh, there might be a plus one. Yes, so she's still 3 3. Six. That collective company was. It was okay. Yeah, obviously. Quick planes. Yeah. I knew I needed to hit two. Damn chance, like, oh, uh, stupid. And I'm going to pass. Okay. Yeah. This one's nice about that. It goes Draw. over top of mm -hmm. the, the spear okay. counter spell thing, right? Like, yeah. Yeah, it okay. goes over a bunch of stuff, right? Like, not even yeah. just that. The spear is. Yeah, yeah, you have to just yeah, like, have to do a bunch of That's not my like, like, thing. Yeah. The problem is, is, like, the deck can't afford to be used. Narrow enough. It's got to be so versatile. Can you make concessions to that? Mm -hmm. I've always preferred to be a soft combat. Go to combat. Mm -hmm. Swing for five. Okay. Or away from. I will attempt a lightning helix. Okay. In response, I am going to. Hey, white. And. Okay, so I gotta make my math here is correct. So we've got 3, 2, 3, 2, 4, 3, 2, 3, 4. Sure. That won't be enough. So yeah, I'm gonna have to crumb and get it onto um, Mabel. So she'll get plus 2, plus 2 until end of turn. Yep. Um, you're still getting your three, and that's part of why I can't do that anymore. Um, but also, I cannot target him with anything, so you'll take one, or two, sorry, from him. Because she's blocked with no trample. Sure, six total. Five, five, oh, one, one? I thought she was blocked, but there's a lightning house. Yes, thank you. Yes. Um, five, two, so seven total, you gained three, so you'll take four. Uh, you yes, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So down to six. six. Yes. Um, second main phase. Wait a minute. She's five, right? Oh, it's still too short. Okay. 
Well, one short. Right. But, uh, I will go ahead and pay two, and we will move the sword here, um, and it will trigger, give the one one counter, and I'll pass. Oh, this is the new Bobbish thing. Right? Yeah. Well, a couple sets ago. Okay. Oh, this is the saddle. Yeah. Oh, my math was right. I'm just dumb. So it attacks, and it's normal Bob. If I saddle it, it's. I draw the card, you lose the life. Okay. Then we'll walk here. Yeah. Kind of a straight point. Yep. And he's a 4-4 four, four, and 3-3. Three, three. Yeah. Uh, Vigilance, Trample, Haste, and when he dies, he'll do a 4 damage to each card. Start. This is really kind of shitty. <laughs> Most of you. Oh, okay. so 6. I don't know what it does. I'm going to scoop. Well, you're dead. Okay. Okay. I won't waste your time. I can, no, yeah, I can honestly, play I, it out, but there's no <laughs> way I can the, stop. The thing is, I, I had bad there's math, too. I was... I'm gonna fling him. Nice. Oh. Because if I so I was like, oh, if I put the two two on him instead of Mabel, that makes him a four four. He'll get four damage into you. I'm like, oh, but four that's only eight. But technically, left you one. It's it's four, and then four from this, and then the the fling. Okay. So. But yeah. Oh, so but why? That's what that does. To be fair, the fling is new. Okay. The fling is very new, and it's actually mostly sideboard against decks like yours that sure. can just threaten to throw everything I have away. Sure. So it's like, all right, well, uh, you're looking at probably doing it next turn. Let me get some extra damage. Yeah. Um, or it is also it also makes the turn three kill way more consistent. Um, turn three is basically Heartfire Hero, pump at turn two, and him for uh, the gold beat so either Manifold Mouse or Mantras Rage. So you hit him for four. And then the next turn, uh, Monstrous Rage, Crumb and get it, fling, they're done. It's, it's 16 exactly, without, without even attacking. So if, if you, yeah, if they're open, you can just attack them first, hit them, and you can do a total of, so technically it's a turn three, you don't even need to attack them turn two, because you can deal uh, 24 damage on turn three. Yeah. And it's because the mouse die, when he dies, he, it's the scamp effect. And the fact that he grows himself, it's like, oh, I'm making a ticking time bomb. Yes, please. I mean, that's just as fast as a mono red deck. Yeah. It really can't be. So that the the best version of this deck is the mono red one that is running the all the other effects because you can still do the same thing with the mouse. Yeah. You don't even have to have, do a slick shot. Yeah. Did you guys just scoop Brandon or? Oh no, I left him. He yeah. gave me the win because he was in last, and then he beat me in the last. <laughs> I don't. Yeah. Mono blue control. He had the stupid T Rex out on turn three. I, yeah, I yeah. I had that. I had to deal with that too. It was rough. Good luck. Good luck. Good yeah, we'll see if it. We'll see if it keeps continuing on whoever's on the play. In this. The exhilarating Boros matchup. Yes. Make a man. I'm gonna keep. It's probably wrong, but I'm gonna keep this. <laughs> we'll take it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> put a mountain in pass. Draw. Yeah. That makes us a little better. Shock myself. Play a fleet foot for for the master. Turkey yeah. goose. Their names are all four words shoved together, and it's really making me struggle. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Good. Uh, yep, your turn. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I have not missed it. Yeah. Not yet. That is a little unfortunate. Um, Esther. And pass. Untap. Draw. I'm going to shock myself again. The word for flying. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to pay two. <laughs> I'm going to play a manifold mouse. Okay. Go to combat. Yep. Gonna give this guy double strike. Yep. He gives himself plus one, well, all mice plus one, plus one until the turn. Swing four damage total. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I'm going to respond. Yeah. Four. I have a response. Yeah. yeah. Five uh, damage to target attack. Okay. I was assuming it was gonna be a helix. Yeah. <laughs> pass turn. Untap. Draw. I'm gonna pass. Oof. Yeah. Let's see if I'm any better. It was a good hand, just two later. I'm going to pay a red in Ancestral Anger. Gives it plus X plus O. It's going to be one. But I draw a card. Land for turn. Uh, 
and that's a plus one. I'm going to then tap two. Yeah. And she goes ahead. Go. No, we're going to tap a red. And we're going to monstrous rage him. So his plus, he's getting plus three and the monster token. No valiant. Um, so nothing else. So he's going to be a two... Three, a five, three. Okay. Go to combat. Yep. Give him double strike. Yep. Hit you for ten. Lightning helix. Yeah. Matt. Seriously. <laughs> oh, God damn it. You can go back. Me and take it. Okay. I it's saved it specifically. I have a Lauren's escape to protect him. Yep. So I'm gonna <gasps> cast the Lauren's escape. Okay. To um, give him hex proof. Okay. So. Yeah, that fills. So, so you hit me for 10. And I scrap one. And. Good night. Draw a card. Lose life. Go to the next game. It's all lands. Yeah, I keep that there. I know that. So, yeah, you're at 10 then? Yep. Yeah. Pass. Yeah. Almost hit it. Yeah. Yeah. That, that dude seems way Got a land. That comes yeah, that's I guess a tap one, isn't it? Enough. Uh, I don't know if that's good enough. That's a lot of I guess I'll leave that like there. Let's see if I make it another turn. Okay. Yeah. Like, yeah. Draw. Uh, that's what made the difference there. Because if it was just like, like go to combat. Yep. Like, Give him double strike. Okay. Yeah. Swing. Okay. Uh, no blocks. Nope. Uh, four damage. I'm gonna crumb and get it on him. Okay. That will make him just a four-four double strike. Yep. So be eight damage. Yep. And then second main phase, I will attempt to fling it. Okay. Four, five, six. I would say I like the hand was double manifold mouse and a Mabel with the the fling, and I'm like, I think I could in a monster ship. I think I can just run it out as long as I get to the third land. I, I mean, you didn't hit your land, so okay. we didn't even get there. Yeah. Good is games. It, is it the next one? Good games.